Hey guys, Joshua with Josh and Hunter's Adventures and welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're talking about the best knot that I've found to tie for finesse swim baits. We've got a little 2.8 Kitek here and I'm going to show you exactly how to tie this knot. I had been tying a Palomar knot and it had been working really good. They're super strong knots, they're really good. Um, but I've been playing around with a loop knot just a little bit and so far I really like it. Um, one of the great features that about the loop knot is, is a lot of times I'm pitching these uh, little finesse swim baits to the fish that I see on live scope and sort of pin limit down to them. And this loop knot allows that bait just to move just a little bit freer through the water column a little bit better than say a Palomar knot. But let's go ahead and show you guys exactly how to tie this loop knot. But if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell. That way you know when we put out videos. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to go through the eye of the hook two times, just like you would a Palomar knot. Pull your little extra line out there. So we've basically got four pieces of line right there, okay? So what you're going to do is you're going to lay the bait over, over your fingers, two fingers right there, and then you're just going to twist the line two times. You can do three, but two is plenty. So what you'll do is you'll pull the bait through that loop that you made and just cinch the knot down. You can wet it. You can go ahead and wet it if you'd like, but for video purposes we want to make it easier for the video. I hope this shows up good. You're going to have three tag ends. Just make sure you cut the right tag end. Now, that's your loop knot. You can see how much easier it moves through the water column. That's a great little knot to tie for finesse swim baits, guys. Give this knot a try. I really believe it'll help you out to catch more fish when you're throwing little finesse swim baits. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up. And again, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Turn on that notification bell. That way you know when we put out videos. Till next time, this is Josh with Josh and Hunter's Adventures. Thanks for watching.